Hey guys, we're snowballing today. Here's the perks. Thrust, Jokester, Poisoned Weapon, Dagger Mastery, Rupture, and Weak Point. Anyway, enjoy. I'm not even joking. If you don't see anybody juiced in the pregame, just leave. I'm not even joking. There's nobody juiced in here. I didn't see anyone in the pregame. I'm just leaving immediately. <laughs> I want that cape. You may be asking yourself, am I a crackhead for doing this? No, I have weak point and rupture. He has a horseman's axe and a battle axe. I can perma kite this. He wasted both of his abilities and he's trying to heal. It's just free. You gotta abuse their TikTok ADHD against them, man. You just gotta wait. Just wait for them to make a mistake. There's no rush here. Skeleton archers aggroed. You know, we're chilling, we're chilling, we're waiting. Second game on, by the way. Okay, and we get a cave troll counter. Yeah, this is a snowball. This is a snowball. I shouldn't have drank my potion so soon. He's, his is gonna run out before mine does. I should have drank it after I was chasing him since he can't ambush inside the storm or it'll break. If you're going against another rogue, just try and get the headshots first. It's just a stat check simulator. The better rogue will win. Duck, dive, double jump, whatever you have to do to win. How am I supposed to turn this in? Well, I mean, I guess it's a good video if it takes two seconds for me to load into a game, get over a thousand gold worth of gear, and then instantly buy a set, and then snowball even more off of it, right? So, I mean, <laughs> yeah. Just so you guys know, this is just a fresh account. That's literally my first raid. So. Anyway, let's see how much we can get from this, and let's see if we can get some good offers in trade chat. This ring, this ring's literally like 400, but this guy's trying to scam me out of 50 gold. Like, come on, bro. Just give it to me, man. Okay, now that we're rich, we're going to go and buy a best in slot uh, Shadow Hood and Marauder's outfit for like zero gold because this game's market is an absolute fiesta, and I don't know what these devs are thinking. But anyway. Can't do that. Wow, guys, that was really hard. It took me about one minute of playing the game. I took me one raid. It took me legitimately one raid. I just woke up. I loaded into a game thinking I wasn't going to get anywhere, and now I'm full I'm full kit. Okay, sure, this sucks, but I am full kit. And here is good. You have the uh, lion's head chest. Sometimes the golden chest and a gold ore spawn right here. I think I can spawn two gold ores sometimes. I'm not sure though. It might always be cobalt because these two always are. I've never seen two gold, but one does spawn right here. In the top right corner of the map, there's this breakable wood. If you fall down, you can go and loot a royal coffin, which has really good pendants, rings, and exquisite goblets for gold. If you escape with one of these, you are sure to add a royal cost to your set. Careful of bats though. You don't want to die. But L7's oh, in wow. chat for Samato. Yeah. So How are you so fast? <laughs> That's unlucky. This dude has like... Yeah, look at that. Yeah, he has additional move speed on everything. Did it's you guys impossible. do it? No. Sadly. So is there... You said there's three. We're having the Wait. third guy. I killed the third. Oh. Wait, they what both have Kuma's claws. They have like literally 50k on them. That's insane. Right here is the graveyard. This is where you want to go grab your first chest before you get flanked by 15 people. You go right through here and just make the wizard blow himself up with a quick fireball. Be careful of not getting hit in the back because there is a lot of skeletons. Plus two all hats, so that's like 1k.
if the cockatrice or the wraith spawns here, you can cheese them on top of this brazier if you have double jump. Fun fact. If you brought lock picking, there's a chest right over here in a shrine. This chest spawns if you have lock picking. <sighs> there's also a cave here that spawns a lion's head chest that's usually open. Up there, there's a lock pickable chest and skeleton champion if you want a chance of getting a gold key. Forgot anything. Probably a few things I'm forgetting, but these are like the basics. To wait for me to kill it first if i don't kill it how am i supposed to actually do anything killing other players is actually the best way to get loot especially if you can bait people from troll counters if you really really want some gear in high roller goblin caves this is easier because people are generally more bloodthirsty and even more geared than usual here are some of my favorite spots after i kill this bard I'm about to drop some forbidden knowledge on you guys here in one moment. I'm talking forbidden. They don't want you to know. Look at this spot. This is the spot of all time. Up here. Boom. Someone's doing cave troll. Right here. It's nuts. It's like spectator POV. You can also go up here. That's not more your style. Right here. <laughs> Also go up here. Go up here. And boom. Look at this spot. This spot is nuts. You guys even know I'm here. good sit right here okay he can definitely see my feet but this is a so rat strat and a half if you want to drop on somebody with an ambush proc they might be looking so make sure you're uh, stealthed if you hear them walk up that's also a good jump up right there there's also this spot where you can jump from this ramp to this with double jump your most valuable kills is the other rogues. Always try and get them if they're geared, because they have the best possible gear. Help, help, help! Hey, give me that loop back. That's mine. You can actually cancel that ability if you stealth as they use it. Fun fact, if you didn't know. Uh, I have a full guide coming out tomorrow, so subscribe if you want to see that. Uh, it's going to be a good one. The game is pretty easy. It's, like, just way too easy, so. Look, man. Give me my loop back. There's the loot. I hope you guys picked up something semi-informative from this video. Uh, High Roller Goblin Caves is dead. I might get into some more 3v3s. I'm not sure, really. The game's just kind of easy. I'm sitting on like 10k gold. But I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your guys' day. I hope this helped you in some way. Have a good rest of your guys' day. Peace.